back to the Solon's customer video series. In this video, we're going to go over how to register for a Solon's Cloud account. So to start, open your Chrome browser and type in solonscloud.com. That will take you to this home page here. This is where you will also log in once you have created an account. And we also have the handy forgot your password option if needed. So even before registering for your account, you can see we've got this useful data calculator. It can help you determine which plan you're going to need, your annual data plan. So to go over each of these things, the sample rate, that is the rate at which your level center telemetry system is going to take measurements or collect data from your connected data loggers. The report rate is the rate at which the level senders are going to send that data to the Solon's cloud. The number of logger channels, so that is the number of parameters that your connected data loggers are measuring. So for example, a level logger 5 is going to have two channels as it's measuring level and temperature. And then you're going to enter the number of level senders that are reporting to the Solon's cloud. So let's do a little example. We'll do five minutes sample rate reporting data every 60 minutes. Let's say we just have one data logger with two channels and just the one level sender. So if we calculate that, you can see how much data you're going to be using on an annual basis. And from there, you can see the plans that are available to you. And you can upgrade these plans at any time. OK, let's get started and register for an account. So click register. Our first step is to enter all our contact information. And this email address that you're entering is going to be the email where you receive notifications from Solon's Cloud, such as alarm notifications, which you will get into in a later video. So come up with a good, strong password. And then step two is entering the billing information. Okay. And once you've got your information in there, click here and take a quick read of our terms and condition of service. So once you've got through here, you can just click close and then check off that you've read it and then check off here. So we know that you are a real person. So click register to continue on with the registration brings us to step three, where we will select the annual data storage plan. And as you can see, all our plans are charged in Canadian dollars. We also have this useful calculator here, the same one that was on the home page. So you can again use it to determine the appropriate amount of data usage and then therefore the plan that you require. And then you come down here and you see all the plan options. I'm going to select the free annual plan as we're not uh, sending too much data to the cloud. But you can, as I said before, upgrade as your data storage needs change. And once we've selected our plan, we just proceed to checkout. Now we can complete our registration. So you can see here, we can confirm that the plan selected is the free 10 megabytes option that we selected previously. And here you should also go over all of these points as they are what you were agreeing to by entering your payment details below. All right, once you've got your payment information in there, make sure it all looks good and select pay now. You will receive this message that your payment was successful. And also at this time, you're going to be sent an email and there will be a link to confirm your registration. And once you do confirm that you're registered, you can then go back to the homepage and log in with your new account information.